everybody with the end of handicapping and thoroughbred racing with my home track and national race course, Grandville, Pennsylvania, on Saturday night, June the 25th, and this is my dayatthetrack.com race of the day. Let's take a look at race 7 this evening, folks. 7.45 p.m. Eastern Post Time. It's a mile test on the dirt track. Three-year-olds and up racing for a claiming purse of some $20,000. Contenders, number one, Firehouse Willie. Number six, Colonial Jones. Number seven, Bon Yur. And number two, Delicious Storm. Number one, Firehouse Willie is the overall speed leader in this claiming field tonight. Racing at the mile distance on the dirt. Comes off back-to-back -back power run wins in his last two starts. Jockey William Otero and the very, very sexy trainer Stephanie Beatty. Go ahead and tell her that, folks. Sent in postward tonight. They fit the board with 56% of their entry saddle as a team to date. Number six, Colonial Jones, has hit the board in two of his last four, including a power run win in his second race back. Race seven summary number one, Firehouse Willie, tops the contenders list tonight here at Penn Nat which also includes number six, Colonial Jones, number seven, Bon Yur, and number two, Delicious Storm, one, six, seven, two, and the seventh from Penn National. Bonus long shots, Prairie Meadows in Iowa racing. Race eight here in the $250,000 grade three Iowa Derby, a four to one shot. Number eight, Callum's Posse, a slightly better speed racing at or about tonight's distance of eight and a half rungs on the dirt than the favorite. Number five, Astrology. Canterbury Park in Minnesota, race five, the 15 to 1 bomb. Number one, Valise, the overall speed leader in his claiming field, racing at or about today's distance of eight and one half furlongs on the turf. So from Penn National on a Saturday night, Rick Needham for day at the track.com, reminding you as always to please bet with your head, not over it. <laughs>